Yo, what's going on everybody? Hope everybody is doing well. Today we're going to be talking about the new Kuva weapon, which is of course the Kuva Sobek. I actually really like the Sobek shotgun, and when I heard that DE released a Kuva version, I knew I had to get my hands on it and make a build for myself. And I can say I am fairly impressed. This build is pretty awesome. I actually have the toxin element on my Kuva Sobek. I got a 28% toxin bonus. I got the acid shells mod, of course, so that any enemies we kill with the Sobek will actually explode. And then I actually have a Riven mod for the Sobek as well. And I'll be pairing this weapon with my main Warframe Chroma, who has the Helmet Ability Norse, so I'm going to be getting that Viral Damage bonus, and I'm also going to be rocking Toxin Elemental Ward, and that combined with Chroma's Vex Armor is going to help this weapon do a lot of damage. Yeah, with that out the way, let's go ahead and get into the mod setup. In the Exilus slot, I got Galvanized Acceleration for extra projectile speed, I got Galvanized Hell for extra multi-shot, I got Frigid Blast paired with Toxin Barrage so I can get Viral as well as extra status chance, Burden Magazine for extra ammo, Prime Point Blank for a flat damage bonus, Prime Cleanse Corrupted for a multiplicative bonus on corrupted enemies, acid shells of course to cause enemies to explode whenever we get a kill with the Sobek, and then I got a Riven mod known as Igni Satidus. This Riven mod gives extra multi-shot, extra crit damage, and extra heat damage, which is a really amazing Riven mod, but due to the amount of Kuva that I actually am sitting on, I've been really thinking about re-rolling and just straight up making a video on me trying to get a better roll for the Sobek. Like I said earlier, I am pairing this weapon with my main Warframe Chroma. The Chroma build I'm using in this video actually has the Norse helmet ability so I could get that viral damage boost on my weapons. I also do have toxin elemental ward so I can increase the reload speed. The amount of damage the Sobek can actually do thanks to the Vex armor damage bonus is pretty damn amazing. And yeah guys that's pretty much going to be it for this video. Before this video ends real quick just wanted to say thank you guys so much for all the support on the channel and yeah guys that's going to be it for me. Keep your head up stay positive and with that being said thanks for watching.